Today we're going to be looking at one of my favorite binding hitch knots. This is the spar hitch and we'll also tie this in the quick release form but when it's in its quick release form it's actually called the bag hitch. This is an old Miller's knot that they use to tie up bags with and it's a, a really great knot. It really is. This is again one of the best binding knots that that I use and the reason I like this one over something like the constrictor is because once it gets unloaded it is very easy to untie and then once it's loaded it holds incredibly strong so it's actually one of my favorite binding uh, binding hitches. Let me show you how it's tied. So to tie the spar hitch you will start out the same way that you do the clove hitch. One wrap around then cross over and another wrap around. Instead of going through the center like you would with the clove hitch, you'll come to the outside, you'll be forming that X, and then you'll cross over, lift up on the first loop, and tuck it underneath. And then you can tighten it all down, and that is the spar hitch, a very, very simple hitch to learn. Now, you can put it in its slip form. Again, like I said, once you put it in its slip form, the name is actually different. It's called uh, the bag hitch. I just call it the slip spar, though and you can put it in its slip form as well. It's actually a very, very good knot. This is the one that I usually use when I'm starting out the first tie for the trucker's hitch. This is the spar hitch.